Hi, this is Little Help Through the Week with me, Daniel Johnson, and we're talking about slowing it down, taking your time, not rushing to get those things done that you kind of need to spend a little bit more time thinking about and doing. We look around our houses, where we live, where we stay, and there's so many things that we'd like to get done, and then we try and do it really quickly, and then we look back and we're like, ugh, this looks terrible. Well, we do that with ourselves. We don't give ourselves enough time to have time to ourselves or time with other people. Or, you know, when we're learning something new, I always go on and about sort of tennis or doing paddle boarding and things like that. I expect to be, a, you know, good at it straight away. And I'm not and I'm slightly annoyed about it, but I shouldn't be good at it straight away because everything takes time. And then you've earned it. It hasn't just come easily. And if it does come easily, great. That's wonderful. But... Actually, when you have to try and put a couple of, you know, years behind you of doing stuff and see how far you've come, that's because you've taken your time. You haven't just rushed through it. So what I want you to do, it's Tuesday, I want you to think about and write down, as always, in your notes or a piece of paper, a book, whatever you want to do. And I want you to just think about a couple of things that are going on right now in your life that you would like to achieve and get done. But they're going to take some time. Right, And then I want you to write next to it how long you think it's going to take you. right? And then add a little bit more time on top of it. Honestly, take your time and you will get it done. It will take longer, but then it is done. Then it's procrastination or you doing it wrong. Okay, so this one's quite fun. Write things down and how long they take. We'll see you back tomorrow.